New South Wales Police is joining with Crime Stoppers Australia for the 2015 launch of Operation Rome. Um, operation Rome has been a highly successful uh, operation that we've run previously. And it's a, an opportunity for New South Wales Police to partner Crime Stoppers and most importantly our community in making Australia and New South Wales a much safer place. Um, from time to time we see fugitives who are known to be uh, widely spread across the country who perhaps escaped one jurisdiction and fled to another. Um, on this occasion and this morning we've uh, released information you may have seen in regard to Brady Hamilton been outstanding for the 1999 murder of a man in uh, Erskine Park in New South Wales and, and we're seeking his arrest and extradition warrants are available to, for him. Um, throughout the week we'll also be releasing uh, information about other fugitives that are missing from New South Wales and we're seeking to locate. Any piece of information from the community can assist us greatly. Uh, Crime Stoppers has shown in the past that even a small piece of information can be of great assistance locating these fugitives. Last year four of them were located in the first 24 hours of the operation and 12 throughout the course of the operation. Two have also been identified overseas and efforts have been made uh, in regard to their arrest. So with that it's most important for me though to emphasise that people should not approach anyone uh, who is wanted by the police. Some of these uh, fugitives are known for very serious and violent offences. People with any information should contact either triple zero or Crime Stoppers on 1800 With that, I'll hand over to Peter with some further information about the efforts of uh, Crime Stoppers Australia throughout Operation Rome. Uh, good morning, everyone. Um, as the CEO of Crime Stoppers in New South Wales, I'm taking this opportunity to urge members of the public to have a look at today's uh, press, media. Um, Look at these people very closely, have a close look. They're living somewhere in the suburbs. They can't be hiding on a rock somewhere. They're living somewhere in our community. And these people have, uh, are wanted by police, um, either in New South Wales or in other states, and they have blended into our community. Um, but we don't want to approach them directly. Um, and if you have any information, you can call Crime Stoppers and you can remain anonymous. You can also go online and report to Crime Stoppers anonymously online. And if your information does relate to a, an arrest, resulting in an arrest, then there may be a reward paid. But under any circumstances, you shouldn't approach these people. So there are 7 million people approximately living in New South Wales, and we're looking for about 20 people uh, who are either from New South Wales or from interstate. So if you can help us make New South Wales and the country a safer community, then that would be fantastic for all of us. Thank you.